guys, this is Allison with Crafty Creatures. Today I'm going to show you how to turn this into this, using supplies from your subscription box. We're going to start our drawing by making three hills, one in the foreground, one in the middle ground, and a tall one in the background. Mix blue and a bit of black paint together and fill in the sky. Then mix brown, yellow, and a bit of black paint and fill in the hill in the background. Add some green paint to the mixture and fill in the hill in the middle ground. Then mix in a little bit of blue paint and paint the remaining hill in the foreground. Then set your painting aside to dry. When your background paint is dry, grab a marker and you're going to draw a fox in the middle of your canvas standing on the hill in the foreground. We're drawing our fox in this picture, as the stories say, the fox in the sky rubbing against the mountains causes the colors that make up the aura borealis. Using white paint and your small paintbrush, do the initial stripes of the northern lights, then use a flicking motion to only flick upwards to create the rest of the lights. Still using your small paintbrush, fill in the fox with black paint. Next we're going to paint a tree off to the side of our canvas. Start with one vertical stripe and then some lines that come off the side that dangle down a little bit and give it some leaves on each side. Repeat this for the other side as well to flesh out your tree. Next, use your small paintbrush and some white paint and very carefully add some highlights to your tree, your fox, and the mountains. And then set your painting aside to dry. With all the background paint dry once again, we're going to add some color to all the white spaces. So mix some green paint and some yellow and carefully go over all of the white items. Then take some yellow paint and add some highlights to the northern lights just to finish it off. And there you have the Northern Lights painting. Thanks for crafting with me today. I'll see you next time.